Well, hello everyone and welcome back to Lisa's Counting Corner. DIY Chews reached out to me again, asked me if I wanted to show some more diamond paintings to you guys. Well, of course. <laughs> Let's see what's in here. We have, I believe, five of them. Yes. Let's do this one first. As you can see, it's a special drill. <laughs> Love the special drills. Oh, sticks to the bag, eh? There we go. So much fun getting back into that plastic sleeve. Let me zoom you in just a little here. Okay. As usual, you get your standard toolkit. Now with special drill diamond paintings, sometimes you will get this plastic tweezers. Um, can help you get the larger special drills on the canvas. Kind of hard to pick up sometimes if you use the wax in your diamond painting pen. Um, so, yeah, you will occasionally see that. This is a 30 by 30. I love hummingbirds. Um, reminds me of my mom. She loved her hummingbirds, too. And I just love that it's in this circle frame. It's supposed to go this way, I guess. <laughs> It is, like like I said, 30 by 30. There are 15 symbols in here. That's quite a few. Very nice and clear. Look at all them beautiful colors. Oh, with the gold around the outside. So let's get into the drills. Okay. Oop, got one more in here. I will zoom you in. Look at that pretty pale pink. A pale pink. Boy, I'm screwing up today. <laughs> pale blue. I did the same thing in another video. <laughs> we'll save the special drills for the end so we have all of the rhinestones or crystals. So this must go around the outside. And just a plain white round drill. Red. Green. A little bit lighter green. Oh, look at that pretty pink. And an empty one. Ah, oh, there's a hole in it. What color was that supposed to be? Uh-oh, number seven. Oh, that's not good. Number seven. It's supposed to be a light blue also. Oh, I bet you that's... Yeah, they did put it separate. Okay. <laughs> I'm like, shoo. Okay, so, yeah, we do have the number seven. They did catch the fact that that one was cut open. So, that's good. Oh, look at this beautiful dark purple. Ooh, that's pretty. Another yellow. Really pretty blue lavender. Now blue. I was going to say blue lilac. Blue violet. Now to the special drills. We have our red rounds. Big whopping pink rounds. Ooh, that's pretty too. Some smaller, real pale, uh, kind of golden round. So again, that'll be going in the outside border. And then the bright yellow rounds, more in the border. Oh, that is going to be so pretty. And then our green rounds. So all these yellows and golds for that outside border. Oh, that's going to look so pretty against that rainbow hummingbird and flowers. 
All right, let's zoom back out. I didn't show you the thumbnail. <laughs> I'll show you now. So that is what it will look like. They're pretty. Okay, so let us get this packaged back up. Oh, we have a really long baby to put these in. Let's see, can we go one more? Yeah. The longer I can make it, the better to fit in that plastic sleeve. <laughs> I am sorry to those who hate this plastic sound. You will have to mute or else fast forward. Some of you like the ASMR sound of this and some of you don't. So, kind of hard to please everybody. Those of you who like it, you get a lot of it. <laughs> Can't forget our number seven. Okay. There we go, and hopefully we'll get it back in that plastic sleeve. I like to just start getting it in and then flip it over because it's hard to get it in there with the sticky on that side. You can do it, Lisa. You can do it. There we go. All right. All right, let's take one that's in a white sleeve. <laughs> so much easier to put away. Oh, another special drill. Must have been on a special drill kit when I picked these out. <laughs> we have what looks to be a, like a Cheshire cat. Look at all these colors. There are 10 colors in this. As you can see, it's a 30 by 30. Yeah, don't you love all the teeth in there? I love the eyes. Those you do not drill, nor the teeth. So technically it's a partial. Many of your special drill diamond painting, matter of fact, most of them are technically partials. But this one you do drill the vast majority of it. So this will be a really fun one to do. Let's take a look at the pretty special drills. Alright, so not too many colors in this one, but oh, some gorgeous blues. Look at this. So we have that paler blue and that gorgeous aqua blue. Love that color. A dark blue. Well, kind of royal blue. And a pale aqua. Oh, those two are going to go together really pretty. Looks to be a black, which is not a crystal or rhinestone. It is just a plain black round. Golden yellow. And then we get to special drills. So we have these iridescent orange teardrops. The rhinestone red teardrops. The small beautiful peridot colored rounds. Oh my gosh. Look at how teeny tiny. Wow. Red teardrops. 
I'm sure those are used for like fill-ins in here and that's why it looks like it's drilled so much. You fill in with those itty bitty ones. <laughs> these two kind of, but yeah, these. Wow. All right. Where is the thumbnail? Now, looks much darker in this picture. That's why I like to show you guys the drills because really gives you an idea of what the picture is truly going to look like because while this is very pretty, as you could see by some of the bright colors, it's going to be brighter than this. Okay, so now I will zoom you back out. So, yeah, a little bit more drilling on this one. It'll take you a little bit longer, but... These are always so much fun to do. When I'm working on a large one upstairs, love to take a break from them and do something that's simple and fast like these. You know what I'm going to do? I'm going to save this, put it in one of these sleeves. Like this one's real tight in here and I'm going to save it for this one. <laughs> So, I'm going to save this thumbnail here. Alright, so let's do this one next. Because this is a 30 by 40. So, yeah, it's it's in here kind of snug. Would be hard to get it back in this plastic wrapping. Oh, and I don't want to rip this. But it's not coming open. Well, I'll just tape it shut, I guess. Wow, I don't have this problem usually. So, yeah, we're just going to, we're going to rip it open. Huh. I have to see if I have a spare white baby. <laughs> All right. So again, it is a 30 by 40. Look at our cute kitty on a swing. Now this is a winter scene. I know it's getting to be summer out. <laughs> but I thought he was just so cute. Swinging on the swing. It's not even hanging on over here. He's going to fall. <laughs> there are 24 colors in this diamond painting. And there is quite a bit of confetti around the outside. Not so much in the hat and scarf, but, you know, in through the body it's not too bad. But the outsides, this isn't too bad. But yeah, the rest of it's quite a bit of confetti. This is a full round. Isn't he adorable? <laughs> All right, and it is pre-baked for you, pre-kitted, so I can see where it opens, there we go, it's always so easy to kit up when they are already in Ziploc bags, or there's actually no need to kit up. I always do. I never work out of baggies, but that is totally up to you. So I'm going to zoom you in. Right, we have this real pale tan. It's kind of almost like an off-white. And then some white. Brown. Another brown. A blue for the background, and as you can see, the number is on the baby. These are nice babies. Kind of a brick red. Oh, that color's pretty. Along with that one, the colors must be in the hat and scarf. Tan. Oh, look at the bright orange. 
and the red. So quite a few colors in the hat and the scarf. Some of it may be in the swing. A blue. Yeah, a lot of colors in this thing. Another brown. A lot of this blue. Background blue. Another brown. Light brown. A lot of peach. Another gray. Tan. Another blue. Let's unfold it. And finally, ooh, big bag of gray. Oh, there's more. <laughs> more gray. And a red. Thinking that one goes maybe down in the swing. Maybe not. Might go up in the hat. I'm not sure. Okay. Let us look at the thumbnail. Ain't our kitty so cute? <laughs> Adorable. Zoom you back out. Let's get this one back in. Ah, oh, baby. When it's pre-bagged in these type of plastic bags, it's not near as loud. <laughs> it's only crinkling from the other bag. So if that sound bothers you, these aren't near as bad. Yeah, this one is going to need, I think, yeah, this one's going to need a bigger, all right, I'm going to have to see if I have an extra white sleeve to put that one in, because, yeah, that's not going to work. Let's put our thumbnail on, I think I have one out in the living room that I can use. Alright, on to the next. This one looks a little bigger. Oh, yes. So this is a 40 by 40. A little bit bigger. Look at our husky puppy. Oh, those blue eyes. Reminds me of a, my youngest daughter's husky when she first got him. Oh, he's still gorgeous, but boy, as a puppy, he was so cute. Not only the blue in the eyes, but this blue tennis ball. <laughs> I've never seen a blue tennis ball. I think it's a tennis ball. All the white in the background, so we know we're gonna have a lot of white, because there's a lot in here too. So this one does not have a lot of confetti. We do have some confetti in the background down here and some in the husky himself, but the vast majority of this is not confetti. Oh, he's adorable. Okay, let's look at the drills. Another one that is pre-kitted up for you, pre-baked. If you're wondering why some of them are pre-kitted up, some of them aren't, all of these companies work with different manufacturers depending on what the picture is. So, so they all create their diamond paintings a little bit differently and package them up differently. So, all right, let's zoom in. So we do have the DMC code on the bags. So this is black 310. Look at our huge stuffed pack of white 3865. 
ป้าอ๋อ Our other colors, we have some brown, gray. Of course, we're going to have a lot of grays in our husky. It's kind of a blue gray. Super pale. Uh, like a, it is like a mint green, but just a little bit of mint in there. We do have these two blues. This is the real blue of violet. Kind of a dark mauve and a little bit lighter. And a maroon. Oh, don't those three go together beautifully? Try to get the shine off of it a little bit there. That's pretty. Pale peach. Oh, look at that teal. Must be in the shading of either the eye or the eyes or that tennis ball. I'm thinking it's the tennis ball. I don't think there's teal in the eyes. So we do have some more grays, warm and cool grays. Really pale pink. Another blue, another brown, really light tan, another blue, and another gray. So all those shades of gray. Oh, he's going to be so cute. And this is the thumbnail. <laughs> he's so adorable. Okay. Zoom you back out. Get this one kitted it back up. I don't know if you can hear the wind outside. It's just beautiful today. So I have the window open next to me. Put on back together. So yeah, I'm going to see if I can use that white sleeve that I have out in the living room from a diamond painting that I'm working on out there for that demolished white plastic or that yeah that white now clear <laughs> plastic sleeve that I will not be able to use. That very rarely happens. So, <laughs> all right, get this back in here. Thank you. <laughs> okay, finally, we have this one be a little bit bigger again now hopefully I won't have to rip this one or I'll have to find two ah it is so I'm gonna have to find two extra white sleeves mm, I don't know if I have two <laughs> I'll borrow one from a diamond painting I'm gonna be doing shortly all right I thought this one was so cute this is another 40 by 40. <laughs> Look at our kitty. <laughs> He's so cute. He has fishies for eyeballs. <laughs> Isn't that adorable? It is so cute. <laughs> We're going to have all kinds of browns and tans and then blues for the background. I imagine we'll have some grays in here. There are 23 colors in this diamond painting. So, quite a few, but it is a 40 by 40. Um, this one is quite heavy, uh, confetti heavy. There is some block drilling in through here, but yeah, a lot of confetti, even in the background, which actually makes the detail of the diamond painting look much nicer. 
Down here there's some black drilling, but for the vast majority of it, the fur especially, there's some that isn't too bad, but like the shadowing and shading. But again, that makes it look so much more detailed when you have the confetti like that. So overall, you know, kind of nice to have the confetti, but yet if you don't like that kind of thing. <laughs> so there's a mix in this diamond painting, which is what I kind of like. I don't like a lot of confetti, um, but yet if you have huge background that's all black drilling, that can get boring too. <laughs> so I typically switch back and forth. And this one is also bagged up for you already. So very nice DIY too. <laughs> Whoever this manufacturer is, I'm glad you work with them. This is so nice. Let's zoom back in. All right. We have this pale sage green. Here's a gray. Another sage green. Oh, look at that pretty orange. Tan. Big pack of blue. And another one. So you know those are background colors. <laughs> well, let's get down here in the camera. Maroon and a real dark gray. Some more blues for the background. Brown, kind of rusty. Another one. Oh, these are pretty colors for the kitty. These look to be, well, this one has just a little bit more tan to it and then this one's a little bit more peach very close mint green wow big pack of this so there's going to be a lot of this color in our kitty another mint green where is the mint green going oh it's up in the little circles up here that would be pretty against the blue. Here we have a violet, another brown, another blue. Lots of shades of blue. Oh, big pack of this too. So this must be the lighter side of the kitty. And then a little bit of white, probably for the eyes. So the fish must be the shades of gray. No, not 50 shades of gray. <laughs> Sorry. All right, so here is our thumbnail. <laughs> he is so cute. Uh, oh, cute picture. Zoom you back out. We shall get him packaged up. And that was all five of them. Are they cute? I will leave, as usual, a direct link to DIY Choose's website, as well as direct links to all of these diamond paintings that I showed you. If any of them caught your eye and you would like to purchase them, I'm not affiliated with any of these diamond paintings, by the way. Diamond painting companies. Yeah, I'm not affiliated with the diamond painting <laughs> Um, They just send them to me to show you guys. So. There we go. So again, another one that I am going to have to find a white sleeve for. So I'm going to leave that here also. So we have, I think just to show you, and I have to take a picture of it for the thumbnail. I'm just going to tape it a little bit on there. 
So we have our cute kitty. We have our husky. We have the other one that has to be packaged, and that's our Cheshire cat. Boy, I must be in an animal mood. We have our cats and our dog. And another cat. I didn't realize that. <laughs> our swinging kitty. So yeah, three kitties and a dog and a hummingbird. Yeah. So cute. I love every single one. So thank you again to DIY Choose for sending these to me to show you guys on my channel. And thank you guys for watching this video. I hope you enjoyed the unbaking of these damn and paintings. If you did, please hit that like button. Subscribe if you're new to my channel. I hope everybody's having a fantastic day. And as always, happy coloring and happy diamond painting. Bye guys.